Hi, good morning. It's almost eight o'clock. Out and about. Um, gonna do a video this morning on. Well, let me just start by telling you what happened. Uh, sent Cole, which if y'all don't know, that's my son. To uh, clients to uh, do some work today, and uh, which was pulling up dead, dead flowers. Pansies are dying this time of year. Um, I done seen him one time before. It is at a com commercial business, um, and they stopped him from doing it because they had some stuff going on. But I, and uh, I sent him back this morning to do it. And there was another company there doing it. So, I am a little aggravated with it. Kind of disappointed that he didn't tell me. I mean, it's, we do, we were doing the flyer beds for him. Um, when I first started doing the flyer beds for me, it's like, man, I can't find nobody to do them for me. I've called, I called, I called, and we jumped in there and we got everything done that he wanted and done it like he wanted it. And he said, oh man, that's great. And was uh, maintaining it. And um, last week they stopped us from pulling the flowers out and he didn't say that that was the reason. He didn't ever, they didn't ever tell us that we weren't gonna be doing it. So, but another company's doing it now. That's fine, that's gonna happen. That's gonna be live. But uh, give me your thoughts, sir. Let me uh, give me some comments on what if it's, this has happened to any of y'all before or whatever. And, but um, like I said, I'm not too disappointed about it. Uh, I am. It's lost work. You're always a little disappointed about lost work. Uh, but he gives me other stuff to do, so it's no biggie life goes on but uh any input or any criticism criticism or anything or any advice will be well taken thank you all right guys it's friday back in the wife's car got some estimates to get ready today oh estimate day yep oh fridays are a good day for estimates if we get too busy, I have to start doing estimates on Saturday, and I'm not gonna like that. But, um, yeah, I went by and looked at everything already at the places or whatever. Uh, I'm here at Lowe's, gonna look at some of the material here and get some prices. Uh, I do like to give my clients options, you know, so, uh, we got one client that's gonna want some landscaping done. Um, she's already taken up, it's just dirt. She's done taking everything else up. She got tired of the bushes were too big. She had, I think she had somebody else take them up, but uh, we gotta fix the ground, fix it so the water will drain out of the flower beds. Uh, put some landscaping fabric down gonna probably put some trenches under the landscaping fabric just to uh because they want mulch and i have a, i have a problem with putting a border with mulch and i know that the mulch is the bark is gonna float up on the mulch and somehow get out of there and i don't like that for my customers so uh gonna do that and uh she wants a border around it i'm gonna look at different prices of border and uh, she wants red mulch. She wants some uh, low maintenance shrubs or bushes. Anybody got any suggestions? We live in uh, Mississippi, Jones County, Mississippi. So if anybody's got any advice on that, uh, that would be appreciated. Which I mean, I can do my homework and I have suggested some, but if anybody has any, that's well taken. I always can learn. Um, and the other one, you know, we do a, 
right now we we don't just do a lot of lawn care lawn maintenance landscaping uh down tree removal uh asphalt patching uh we do some odd jobs when i say odd jobs but this is other one's not odd job she wants a uh small pad built on the side of her carport for like a work truck to park on and uh the water comes down the road and washes into her driveway and washes out where it's going to be going so i'm going to be looking into that for today too so um and i give you some footage throughout the day but estimating day what day is your estimating day? 